all for being here tonight. Um, we have put a lot of hard work into this performance tonight, and it's so exciting to get to share it um, with all of you. So we, since we have a little extra more time, we're going to talk through some people that deserve to be recognized. First, we're going to start with Solo and Ensemble. We actually hosted Solo and Ensemble this year. So thank you to all the people who volunteered their time, students and adults. We had a busy day. There were about at least 500 students here um, from um, schools around our district. Um, I really wanted to thank Vicki Dolphin and Rachel Sepaluk for doing concessions. They did an awesome job. Thank you so much. Um, and we had so much support that day, which was really great to see our community coming together. Um, we had some events that I want to just um, point out. So when you hear your event, you're going to just give a little wave. We have Jens Novak with his flute solo that advanced to state. We went there last Saturday. Um, also getting gold in class A. Oh yeah, you can clap. Mm. clap also getting gold in class A is Sabrina Hillary with her trumpet solo, Jen Snowback with his alto flute solo, and our brass ensemble, um, which got a gold, which is various members of the group. Getting a silver in class A, we had Dominic on the drum set. We had Billingsley with his tuba solo, the tuba solo. Cordelia with her trumpet solo, and our woodwind ensemble, which is Our gold in class B would be Tova Gangstead with her clarinet solo, Jerry's Ashton with his trumpet solo, and Elisa Shishina with her marimba solo. Getting silver in class B, we had um, our flute choir, um, we also had our saxophone trio, and uh, Lissa with her flute solo. We also had for comments only because they did it because I asked them too nicely. Um, the Gorgi Trio, one of them was in sixth grade, but Rick and Ben helped out with that. So thank you for everybody. Now at this concert, the um, the band department always gives out a outstanding freshman, sophomore, junior, senior, and then our Suzo Award. And to tell you that this is extremely hard to do, um, this is a group that is very special in my heart. The seniors, I've had since seventh grade, and they all say I'm gonna cry, which I probably will, so it's fine. Um, but we've had a lot of ups and downs throughout our time together here. Um, and there's some really special kids up here on stage. Um, so this is always hard, but we do it. So for the outstanding, Freshman Award. This goes to someone whose low brass sound has always continues to grow. Um, he is a leader in our classroom every single day. He learns bass. He wants to learn every instrument. Sometimes I have to tell him, okay, like we got to cool it a little bit on the instruments. But so our outstanding freshman is Benny Gorgi. Our outstanding sophomore goes to someone who I'm always so impressed of how much he's improved. I remember teaching him trombone in my office in fifth grade. He's like, hey, um, and like just seeing how far he's come has been amazing. So Kellen Smith. For our Junior Outstanding Band Student Award is going to someone whose musical ability and practice and all of those great things is amazing. Um, we traveled together to Whitewater this last weekend, which was lots of fun, so Jen is no bad. Outstanding senior band member. I think someone whose kindness and leadership is seen throughout our school. Um, everybody always knows that they can rely on you for whatever they need. So, Alyssa Drink. Yeah. 
Our last award is the SUSE Award, and this is a national award that is presented to students who are show their dedication to music, to their instruments, um, to the band program. Um, a very cool tradition. Sorry, I'm right. I know. Um, a very cool tradition here is that they get to conduct the final piece, which is always a Susan March. Um, and so Gabina's going to talk about that later. But the person who is winning the Suzo Award this year is Sabrina Kelly. So as we do our switch, because now I have to play trumpet, um, Mr. Bertelt is going to just. Say hello. <laughs> well, welcome. Thank you again, everyone, for coming tonight. I'm honored to be the principal here at Waterloo. Let's give the students in this office sets another round of applause. I actually don't have much, anything important to say. This is a setup for Mrs. Hawkness sets right now. Um, the seniors came to me last week and wanted to recognize her since it's the seniors' last concert. So I'm actually going to turn it over to Sabrina right now to take over. Um, so, if any of you know me, you know that I'm not someone that usually talks in front of people for fun. That's not me whatsoever. Um, but I couldn't think of a better time to do it than now for Ms. Hawkins. So, um, I just want to start off by saying that, as Ms. Hawkins said, we've had her, us seniors, at least most of us have had her since we were in seventh grade. So, we've known her for five years, almost six, and She's been our band teacher for that long, which is pretty crazy to think about. Um, she's always been a really good teacher, always there for us. She makes us know that the band room is a safe place for us to come to if we need to talk to her about anything. Um, she helps us with everything that we need, and she's always willing to be there for us, which I think is pretty amazing coming from a teacher. Um, so the seniors just wanted to do something nice for you, and I think Alyssa and Matt are gonna come up. Oh. Oh, we just wanted to do that for her. scholarship awarded to a senior who is recognized by their superior musicianship, dependability, loyalty, and cooperation. The song will also be conducted by Sabrina.